All right, YouTube peoples, we're gonna go ahead and go with series number two on cheap budget camera build for the shop today. I'm gonna try to get my, uh, I don't know what you call it, uh, camera arm or whatever, uh, get that all rigged up so I can take better pictures on the workbench and in the garage. So y'all come on. All right, on this episode, we're gonna be modifying the Spana Seal C-shaped C stabilizer for the cameras. I wanna add a light to it also, and there's no other attachment point to add a light, so I'm gonna do that right now. All right, I got me a spot marked here. I'm gonna drill me a hole for another uh, quarter 20 threaded uh, screw. So I can attach my light also. go. All right, picked me up a quarter 20, inch and a half quarter 20 threaded screw. I got the uh, microphone mounted back, the camera's mounted back. Got a couple of washers on each side because I couldn't, there's a little lip right there. I'm going to go ahead and mount our light. All right, so there you go. I've got the light mounted, camera, and the mic. Got the whole rig ready to go. All right, we're gonna move on to the camera arm or boom, whatever you want to call it. Get some overhead shots for my desk, doing leather work or whatever I'm doing on the top of the desk and some I can use out in the, in the center of the garage. Just got me some inch and a half PVC fittings from here. This is the, the Unipod that Walmart sells, uh, that Targus one. Use this on my kayak fishing. I had it rigged up so I could film fishing. But uh, it's been repurposed. Got it hung on the wall there. They go right over my desk. All right, let me show you in action here. That's the center of my desk right there where I always work at. just quickly hang that camera right over my work area if I want to adjust the angle just move it either way just like that that's the quickest way that way I can move from that to uh right here at eye level that's where i sit at so if y'all want to see my pretty face while i'm talking or whatever i can just set it right there real quick and do it this moves out of the way either direction so it's never in my way and another good thing i'll show you all right here's the second setup like i said this whole arm here was my uh, kayak fishing camera stuff has a round ball mount right here with the GoPro attachment that attaches to the camera. So if I don't want the mic and the uh, light and all that mess on there and that whole C rig, I can just bolt it straight to that arm. You can see it's pointing down straight over my desk there. But what you can also do with it, so what, but what you can also do is flip it up 
re release the uh, extension pole. I can move it. And I can move it out here in my garage, all the way halfway across the garage, point any direction I want to, what kind of project I'm working on. It holds the camera just fine. It won't hold the whole, it's too heavy. The C-Rig lighting and microphone's too heavy, but the uh, Ram ball mount, I hold that just fine, but. So there's my rig. Hopefully I'll get y'all some better action shots now. So that's what we're going with. All right, maybe I'll give y'all some ideas for your projects. Alrighty then, as always, we'll see y'all down the road.